Oh, oh, this guy. Oh, she is thorny. Ugh, I don't know about that. I long to see the poetry of his pure fighting style. And that's all. <laughs> It sounds crazy, but I really wouldn't mind being the strongest guy alive. All right, Grandpa, he's like back in my day. Hi, guys, and welcome to the Shan Caravan. In today's video, we're back with some more Paper Mario and the Thousand Year Door. We got an egg. <laughs> the mail always scares me. Bro, I did not see that coming. Uh, another ish seal. Report today, old Toad settles in. It's come to light that after settling into life at our inn, Toad's worth age 60. Dang. It's not that old, but actually he looks worse than 60, I should say that much. It has often been spotted in the company of Zesty, age 55, the notorious finicky. Zesty surprised all when she was heard saying, what's wrong with spending time with my little toadly toes? Ew. The possibility is such a common open has our eyes and ears glued to the situation. Oh, there's a shop in the great tree. That's interesting. I'm just gonna paraphrase these. Spicy soup, we need a fire flower. Mmm. Cool, cool. <laughs> anyway, we got an egg. All right, time to fight. Time to get it on. Like Donkey Kong. Gotta go back to our little digs. Do I need to sleep or am I good? I need sleep. Gotta rest up. All right, let's do this. Reserve a match. Well, boy, howdy, Gonzales. Fixing for a fight, huh? Well, alrighty then, let me just see here. Your next opponent will be ranked 14 in the Glitz Pit, the Handed Overs. Now listen, son, in this battle, I want you to use at least one special move, okay? Crowd needs something flashy. You catch my drift? Give them a good show. Now get in there and blow the roof off, son. Let's do it, let's do it, let's do it, let's do it. Gonzales, match time. Follow me, bub. Sorry, excuse me, sorry. Uh, important people going through. Oh, I gotta leave the little eggy eggy. Granted, I don't need him getting cracked. <laughs> For our next battle, we got the Merciless Executioner, the Great Gonzales, and the Grim Death Burglars. Yep, a fight to the finish with the handed overs. Sounds like, um, Pou Proud Family, the like, I forget their name, but the, the Ashy Girls. <laughs> we aren't going to lose to scrubs like you. <laughs> We're awful quick, awful agile, just plain awful. All right, that's a motto. <laughs> Battle! Get it, get it. Use at least one special move. Let's go. Oh, do I have enough? I don't. Wow. Well, I'm going to appeal. <laughs> it would be the one time I don't have any uh, star power. Uh, let's tattle. I believe these guys can steal stuff from you, so I actually really need to kill them as soon as possible. That's a bandit. That's a that tries to bump you and grab coins, jerk. Max HP is five, attack is two, and defense is zero. If you time your guard well when he attacks, he won't be able to steal anything. Plus, the look on a bandit's face when you guard successfully is priceless. If a bandit steals coins from you, defeat him before he flees to get your coins back. Oh god. Oh god. Ah, got it. Oh Jesus. Oh god, no. Ah! Alright, alright. Do we still don't have enough? Girl. I guess I'll appeal again. Bruh. This is not going to play. <laughs> Thankfully, I'm hoping I only took one coin each. That's a big bandit. Basically a boss among ordinary bandits. Max HP is eight, attack is three, and defense is zero. Unlike other bandits, he'll steal your items as well as your coins. Totally weak. If you guard well when he charges at you, he'll blow by without stealing anything. If he robs you, you won't get your item back unless you beat him right then. He'll run. Yup. Okay, he didn't get anything. Yup. Yep. Well, time to use our special move. <laughs> Just got robbed. Jeez, let's see if I can take him out with one hit. 
Ooh, come on, delay, don't mess me up today. Oh, so close. Please be five. Oh, dang. Well, hey, I can take him out. <laughs> hey. Somewhat successful. <laughs> We got ourselves a winner, the great Denzels. What did you expect, huh? We rock. Hey. Here's your fight money, Mr. Gonzales. You received six coins, rose to 14. Now, if you'll excuse me, I must be going. <laughs> hey, Eggy Wigs. What up, King K? Hey, you hear the latest G-Dog? My boys say they saw a stunning babe having a juice at the fresh juice shop. King K could use a little shorty in his life, dude. Check it out for me, man. All right. I'm not used to people like, I guess that's technically locker room talk. Oh, what's up, bruh? Hey there, Gonzales. How's it going? Me? I'm doing a little research. Hey, speaking of which, ever heard of the seven wonders of the Glitz Pits? Yeah, this place has rumors and secrets and spades, but the seven wonders of the Glitz Pits is the most mysterious of the bunch. These things fascinate me, so I wander around doing research on them. Well, so how about it? Want to hear about the seven wonders or not? Um, sure. <laughs> Let's see, which one do you want to hear about? Oh God, sealed wall, man-eating toilet, stairs of mystery, haunted boudoir, spooky ring lights, the missing ones, Grubba and Jolene. Mm. If you ever want to learn some stuff, just holler. I'll have to listen to that some other time. <laughs> Plus, I think a lot of that gets explained away, like, or talked about throughout this um, chapter anyway, so, eh, I'm good. Not going deep into the lore right now. <laughs> Let's see. But yeah, oh, oh, this guy. Bonjour, Monsieur Mustache. I wonder what fellas that beautiful mademoiselle like. She is like a ravishing but thorny red rose, huh? Oh, she is thorny. Ugh, I don't know about that. Prince Mush, the first glitz pit champion, the fighter long since lost. He shone truly and brightly. Many fans still hope that he may dramatically return. Of course, I'm one of them. I long to see the poetry of his pure fighting style. Seems to be the only one she cares about. And that's all. <laughs> Bye. What y'all got to say? Huh? The Great Gonzales. No offense, man, but I don't follow minor leaguers. Oh, dang. You want to know something? That Rockhawk is actually a total coward, dude. I heard this rumor that he rigged his fight with Prince Mush to make him withdraw. Mm. Hey there and welcome. Our doors are always open for thirsty fight fans. It sounds crazy, but I really wouldn't mind being the strongest guy alive. I mean, sure, every guy dreams that once in a while, but the thing is, I once. No, wait, never mind. G good luck out there. All right, Grandpa. He's like, back in my day, I was the best fighter of them all. All right. Well, we saw she only cares about Prince Mush. But yeah, I'm not used to like locker room talk and people just being like, man, that girl over there is so hot. Check her out for me. Like, why don't you check her out if you're interested in her? I tell you, man, with all the young talent like you coming up in the ranks, I just keep feeling older and older. You know what I mean? King K ain't getting younger. Dang, sorry, King K. Welcome to the automated match reserve. Bleh. Reserve a match. Let's get one more fight in real quick. <laughs> well, boy, howdy, Gonzalez. Fixing for a fight, huh? Well, alrighty then. Let me just see here. Your next opponent will be ranked 13 in the Glitz Pits, the Mind Bogglers. 
Now listen, son, this battle, if you want to avoid switching your partners out, gotta go with who brung you. A fight to the end, side by side. Now that's drama. Now, get out there and stand your part. Stand by your part. Honestly, mind bogglers? I think that means boggly woods, and I'd rather have coops for that. Uh, Gonzales, match time. Follow me, bub. Uh, just let me snap real quick. <laughs> Like, I know I'm supposed to go fight, but uh, let me just sleep real quick. Sleep one off. <laughs> alright, alright. I'm ready. Bye, Eggy Wags. Okay, cool, cool. For our next battle, we got the Merciless Executioner, the Great Gonzales, and the Grey Entanglers. Yep, a fight to the finish with the Mind Bogglers. Um, okay, can we do this? We can do this. <laughs> Prepare to be ensnarled, mystified, and devoured. I don't know about any of that, honestly. Time to battle. <laughs> Don't change partners. Well, let's get you out. It looks like most of you are kind of down low enough. I don't know if I'm gonna hit, yeah, I didn't hit the, uh, what you call it guy. But let's get you out since you got, um, well, item. Mr. Mini. Dang. Well, coops. Looks like I'm stuck with you, even though you're kind of useless at this point. Let's go ahead and get you out before you get a chance to charge up. Bruh. Bruh. <laughs> Jeez, I gotta get back used to the, um, the controls of this game. It's been a hot minute. Hey. Mm -mm -mm -mm. We got ourselves a winner, the Grey Gonzales. We won? Sounds so surprised. She, are you not on my team, on my side? Here's your fight money, Mr. Gonzales. Six coins, rose to 13. Now, if you'll excuse me, I must be going. <laughs> Eggy eggs, what up? Listen, man, keep it under your hat, but I'm thinking about retiring soon. If I stay any longer, well, my future might get shorter, dig? After the next match, I'm gone. It ain't cool, man, that's for sure. But you know what? That's life, Double G Doll. Listen, promise me you won't forget you once knew the King K. Aww. Why you gotta go and make things so complicated? <laughs>